made it back. We're in not too rough of a shape. Feeling good. Rested last night. Got it this morning at Jordan and Roberts. Thanks again, Jordan and Robert. Um, got on the road at what, like 7 o'clock? Yeah, really. It's 11.20, so it took about four hours to get to the Florida border, which is typical from Atlanta. We were in North Atlanta, right? Yeah, we were. A little north. Yeah. And now we got, what, three more hours? Dude, guys, see anything unusual? Sarah I'm is driving. driving. Peter, let me drive. I was hurting this yeah. morning. I don't know why. I didn't think it was like my back. We haven't been like, we've been sleeping in like not in our bed. So you know, like your body just knows when it's not in its home. Yeah. So like my back was just hurting and I was well, feeling tired. Me drive. We'll switch at some point in the next little bit because we gotta edit. I might start, might not. The little bean sprout back here just laid down and is sleeping. And we uh, are in love with Spotify. Yeah. Yeah, we signed up for the Spotify premium with it to go with our Alexas and now we've been listening to it like crazy in the car. And Sarah and I might live in a car and travel the country. You know, just road trip chat about the future. Go. I was like, if we get rid of all of our bills in the next year or two, we could we could get a car, like a van and like live in it and just travel from like place to place mm -hmm. doing odd jobs would you like guys watch it? would you guys watch it if we turned our vlog into like a travel america in the world vlog we would need the vlog to be some of the financial support <laughs> we would need brand ambassadors and then probably some of sarah's graphic design still yeah. but all that can be done from the road and we can have kids in the, in the road too mm -hmm. so we're thinking it but not anytime soon for the next foreseeable future you're stuck with disney the universal also, vlogs like our first priority is our kids Okay, so I realized that, well, one, Peter's back to driving. Two, we're like an hour away? No, like... A little less. Um, I realized that we just kept on calling my cousin Matt. We just kept on calling him Matt Walsh in the vlog. We've, we've talked about him before, but if you're new... He's one of Sarah's closest cousins. He's basically my, my brother. Yeah. So... Okay. This Christmas card had Taylor Swift on it. It said Mary Swift. Did. And he gave everybody... Car a car freshener with his face on it, so we're about to look, put it look up. Look at the back. This is the back of his head. <laughs> so it's like... I forgot to ask him how he had these made. It's like lemony fresh. I don't know if we've ever had a car freshener. Also... What? We're back. <laughs> we're back to normal. 85 degrees. 85 degrees. Oh, is this place for Earth? Yeah, it's just one of dolphin. Our first sighting of Disney. Touched by an angel. Well, we're back home safe and unpacked 80% of the way. Yes. Took a quick nap and now we're at Disney Springs. The line to turn into the garage. Guys, I feed off the energy of the parks being this busy. Yeah. Because for me, like, it justifies it being slow at times. It justifies all the bills are being paid right now because so many people are here. Yeah. And, um, I don't know. We aren't really phased by that. We're optimistic people, so it's... But, okay, but well, it's busy already. It's busy. Okay, we'll talk soon. Yeah. What? Where are we going, Peter? We're what trying... We're trying to use a trick for my friend Justin from Gem Sessions. He told me if... Oh! Rainforest Cafe is busy, go to the Lava Lounge. Not, not many people realize the same menu is available. Okay, so really quick, I'm not trying to say this without being too loud, but we're here at Rainforest Cafe because our wonderful friend Maria F. sent us a, uh, a little Christmas card with a little gift card, so thank you, Maria. Our New Year's Eve celebration is always two days long here in Disney because they do everything on the 30th and 31st, but the New Year's Eve gods are like praising us today. Yeah. They were literally turning people away from the orange parking garage, right. you know, green. Lime, I'm sorry, Lime. The Lime parking garage, they were turning people away and like five cars in front of us, they stopped turning people away and let it, were letting people in. So we got to park. Right away, there was not a wait. And then we come over to Rainforest Cafe 
Sarah saw a reservation available in the car. Well, and because I was like, the line was so long, I was like, let's not make it. We're like, not going to miss. Late. We're, we're going to be like 15 minutes late. So we get over here. The app is no longer accepting waits. They say it's a two and a half hour wait. And the guy's like, you can try the bar if you want. We walk over. Right as we walk up, a couple was just Leave. putting down their, their, their money to go pay their bill. And we got them left. So we just got to sit down right away. Crazy. Magic. Magic. And I saw one of my old co-workers, Willie. Shout out to Willie and his family. Mm -hmm. Check this out. So I got a funky Buddha. Floridian Heffenweizen. I've never even heard of this before, but I'm gonna give it. I'm gonna give it the old try. So we got an ahi poke tower, and then we got the awesome appetizer. And I wonder if they put on the lights because they saw us with this camera, <laughs> because it was like 40% darker just now, and the lights just like came on as they started vlogging. So. Ooh, wait, wait, that's why. Oh, it's I've so never been here before. <laughs> So it has crab dip. <laughs> so thunderstormy. Crab dip, chimichangas, guac, cheese sticks. And I don't know what these are, but they look like chicken. Everything was delicious. Favorite so was the crab dip. Um, and we definitely are gonna go back and go to the lava lounge. I think it was just like too busy of a night to use that trick. But I definitely want to go back because it's right on the water. Um, yeah, we'll do that. Sarah's all about outside eateries, especially on the Always. water. Always. 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 What? 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 Mm. Nothing. It's not it's too busy. I needed that to be my palate cleanser and then go wash my hands. I know. We'll, we'll go get honey. So when Sarah did her little haul from Basin, she showed we we had one of the like, the sleigh, the reindeer sleigh tube. Yes, that's a Basin White exclusive. Here's the other Christmas tube. So there's the red one. This is just winter. It's a winter one, and that looks like a gingerbread orange one. Yeah, and a snowman. And They're a good snowman. For the snowman, gingerbread. Time to wash those greasy hands. But what flavor will she choose? Is the real question. Citrus bliss. I don't know if it's called bliss or not. I just made that up. Put a comment down below if you know what flavor I'm gonna wash my hands with. I'm not even gonna vlog it, so you won't know until tomorrow's vlog. Look at all the people. This is gonna be worth it though. Yeah. The honey's gonna be worth it. And it's kind of on the way to the buses. Yeah. So have we said what we're doing? I just know, Gia Dally, if you start if you start cutting cutting corners. This is our new sweet treat designated by Disney Springs. So delicious and healthier probably than Giardelli. So it looks like we're getting some B-Bads today. And actually they just gave away, Sarah just got the very last, very last trial stick. Oh my gosh. So he splurged. Splurged. We love this stuff. Love it. We haven't had it in months. Yeah. Months. But if you check it out, Amazon.com, you can buy this stuff. Yeah, a whole Disney. case for like 20 bucks. 22 bucks or something. Orange sugar boo. One, show this other one. We opened this This is up. the last thing we expected to be in here. <laughs> like we knew the mouse was going to be in there, but not like that. No, These mice things are like our favorite things ever. They're, They're so, so cute. cute. <laughs> They're a little pricey. Like, this is $32 for this. But I feel like it's worth it. Mouse it's race. Like, I know how long it probably took that artist to make them. And like this is cute on a shelf. Like this isn't you don't just throw this You're away. You're cute on a shelf. So here we are. It's our little trick is we parked at Disney Springs tonight. And we're taking the bus. The bus is surprisingly very empty. We're actually going to take it over to Contemporary and then walk on over to the Magic Kingdom. But this is a nice little break from the crowds. Super excited. I cannot believe it's already New Year's Eve Eve. We stopped this montage to crash the Magic Geekdom's live stream. We're catching up to him. Oh my 
god. I have goosebumps show. all down my leg. We didn't thought they could see any Christmas anything this year. It's this That's on New, top. New Year's Eve Eve miracle number three. First was parking, second was the seat at the bar. Third, no, third was Magic Kingdom and John and Chica. Yeah. Fourth, this is like, and I, I look, I love how much good this camera is compared to our G7X. Because <laughs> I just filmed a bunch in the stage, now looking at the viewfinder, I'm like, this is good. We, like, didn't think we were going to see that. The music is crazy. Like, I can't get over Muppets? this. We're gonna watch Muppets Christmas Carol tonight and tomorrow and tomorrow promise, and tomorrow promise, and tomorrow. Promise, 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 promise. Watching it every day until December 24th, 2019. If you guys are ready for some fireworks, let me hear you say yeah! yeah. Oh, that's right, I think you can get a little bit louder than that. So if you guys are ready to pop, Tinkerbell will soar high above the Magic Kingdom and light our fantasy in the sky. Well, well, we're home. Look, Super we're back late. in our room. Yeah. Super, and I it's almost secretly two in the morning. don't have my contacts. So she's blind. She doesn't have contacts or glasses on. I can't on. see. She can't even see you guys right now. It's two but in the morning. It's two in the morning. Magic Kingdom was magical, utterly magical to mm -hmm. be there. But they the didn't do the numbers. Good. Yeah. Usually they do numbers made of fireworks. Yeah, that was They weird. didn't do that. It's okay. It was still beautiful. Turn yeah. it to daylight in there. Tomorrow is the the whole party time. At the Epcot. real countdown. So, um, I'm excited. Thank you guys for joining us on our Chicago adventures. As always, we always appreciate the love. And uh, have a safe, happy New Year. If you're watching yeah. this, the day goes up. Please be safe and enjoy your time with your friends, families, and loved ones. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. <laughs>
And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.